dress. He sure yeah. can. can he? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. oh, okay. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, this is the second one. Okay. You have to open the card again. It's a riddle. <laughs> and read it loud but slow so everyone can keep up with the riddle. He is joking. <laughs> so first we thought of wine, and of the many birthdays you've had, we were certain that... Sorry, and of the many birthdays you've had, we were certain that You've shared a few with a bottle or three, or three of wine. That's why you've got three bottles of then wine. Then that got us thinking of things that you haven't done in the 50, 50 birthdays you've now had. So skydiving came to mind. Uh, is, that what you're, is that what I'm going to be doing? <laughs> Just keep reading. What better way to wake up the fact that you've reached the, state, the start of old age and bring it to your attention? <laughs> so we had second thoughts of where to schedule the landing. Gift vouchers, uh, ADO Airport, 1st of February 2010, arrival. So that was the mystery, skirt, that was the, the mystery flight. Mystery no, flight. no, that's not, that's not it. Is it? The mystery flight <laughs> to Wyala. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> well, you could have said you are Port Lincoln, but we were just that long ago. I remember Wyala, can't you? That no, years. that actually, you go. That would have been, yeah. actually, go back to... Actually, I was Wyala was when I was repping. Oh. oh, you have been since yeah. you were four years old when you left there. See, aeroplane. Yeah. Any hits? Australia and an aeroplane. Eight thousand. <laughs> All right, mum's turn. <laughs> Come in, take a fast one. This is the last one. Uh. <laughs> All right, I have to read this one down very, very loud. Go stand with your husband. <laughs> Take it away. You've got to open it that way. Like this comes yeah. up. Open it loud. No, you don't lift that yet. No, no. Read it. So we're sending you to London to see someone who has captured your attention for many of your 50 years. You guys are bullshitting me. <laughs> <laughs> You've, uh... Yeah, there you go. Now you can lift it. We bought your flight to London and tickets to see Podrongren. You guys. Because you wouldn't have a birthday party for us. You guys are shitting me. <laughs> no, no, I've paid for it now, so we can't get a refund. So you, you better not be. <laughs> Is it two tickets? Yes, we got you two tickets. What are the other one for? Just for maybe you could find somewhere to go with. But we just got you two tickets in case. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know what to say. <laughs> For once in his life, he's speechless. <laughs> <laughs> All right, listen. That's unbelievable. That's like... <laughs> That's why we were joking this morning yeah. when you are on the Todd Rundgren website. What was he talking about this morning? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, You've got to be kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, What's no, no. the name of the baby? Todd Rundgren. <laughs> yeah, guy. don't worry. No one's he's heard of him either. The <laughs> guy up there. It's in the old days when he was... A He's playing on a street corner in London, so... <laughs> Happy birthday, Dad! No. Thank you. There you go. Uh, nah. Actually, you know what we should have done? We should have said to him the last... Open the last one. Why not try this present? <laughs> That's <laughs> insane. <laughs> so open up the last bottle of wine now. Actually, what we should have done, we should have got you to open the wine first and try and guess 